Hello lady and gentlemen. Today is 28 of November Tuesday evening. Khan Baba is here and welcome back to my channel. Let's start the today important information. The banks now have liquidity with all the currency swaps that we have seen. That are completed. We've got all the meetings with all the different countries on currency swap. These currency swaps are phenomenal because they're going to be clearing the Iraqi dinar with Article 8 compliant currencies. They start them leaving the country to discuss the exchange rates between countries. They're going to start with Turkey. Delegation will head to Ankara, Turkey tomorrow Monday to discuss regulating trade exchange between Iraq and Turkey. The transition away from the dollar is underway. Now there's room for a new exchange rate to come because they're going to finally pass this oil and gas law at some point. The distribution of allocations. For the 2023 budget, investment projects are all going to need the same thing. I think. It's going to be the exchange rate, the newest one, the Article 8 compliant one. They're focusing in on this. There was a content creator who absolutely misinterpreted an article we need to clarify the mistakes that were made so people don't panic. We are not thinking of returning the dollar to its previous price and the problem began under Saddam's central bank when they say return it to the precious price. For some reason the individual thought that meant returning to the $3.22 rate. That's not what they're talking about. Nowhere in the article does it say the $3.22 rate. It just says return it to its previous price. That means the one before this one. That would be 1450 dinar. He's talking about they're not going to devalue the Iraq dinar. An Iraqi delegation will go to Turkey tomorrow to discuss the possibility of opening correspondent accounts for Iraqi banks. They are going there to iron out what they need to do for this currency swap. This is a continuation of what we've been talking about for a couple weeks now. Turkey is one of the countries Iraq will be holding their currency and Turkey will be holding Iraqi dinar. The currency swap. This is good. The chatter in Iraq is extremely awesome right now. I am hearing today that they are educating folks and spreading lower denominations brand new lower denominations. They are more prominent in the Kurdish region now is what I heard. A number of ministers have said that the parallel market will be fixed in the coming days. How are they going to fix that? A revaluation. A significant increase in the value of the dinar at or equal to its face value with 90 trillion dinar. In circulation would in essence, be six times the value of the entire country's wealth. This is why I have stated numerous times that if and when the dinar ever was to go up in value, it would have to go up gradually over time so that the dinar money supply could be reduced. But that only could occur if Iraq's economy began to significantly prosper. Take care and goodbye.